Yes guys, how's everyone doing? Welcome back to the Dugout Football Channel where it is time for match week number 20 of the 2020-21 Scottish Premiership season. Now let's have a quick look at how we did in match week 19. I got 6 points, so very very respectable week for me, including one perfect score and that was Ross County to uh, sorry, Celtic to beat Ross County by 2 goals to nil. So I managed to get that right. I also got the Hamilton Livingston Hib St Mirren and St Johnston Rangers outcome. So I was pretty, pretty happy about that. So the top scorer for match week 19 was Mike Eddy. And Mike Eddy came away with seven points, including two perfect scores. That was Celtic to beat Ross County and Livingston to beat Hamilton. So very, very well done to you, Mike, as well. So as we come into match week 20... Boxing Day fixtures, everyone looks forward to these games. So the big game is obviously Rangers against Hibernian. and that is a huge, huge game for sure. And then we have Aberdeen against St Johnston, Dundee United against Motherwell, Hamilton against Celtic, Kilmarnock against Livingston, and Cross County against St Mirren. So the first game to preview and predict is Rangers against Hibs. The last five between the sides have resulted in four wins to Rangers and one draw. The last result was a 2 1 win to Rangers well you have to say Rangers very very comprehensive victory over St Johnston at the weekend very very well done to the uh, Rangers it was a fantastic performance three goals and a, another clean sheet as well Rangers are just absolutely flying right now uh, aren't they they're just playing really really well don't look like conceding at the moment and that is one thing you can say for sure Hibernian a 1-0 win over St Mirren. Uh, obviously, they will be without Christian Dodge, though, sent off after two bookable offences. Uh, to be honest, you know, you could you can say well, you want all you want, but it was a red card for Dodge, and unfortunately, he will be missing this game. So because of that, I've just got a feeling Rangers will win this one. Rangers to win this one. Rangers 2, Hibernian 0. And that would make move them onto 16 points clear of Celtic. But we, we shall see what happens for sure. So we have Aberdeen against St Johnston. The last five between the sides have resulted in two wins to Aberdeen, two draws and one win to St Johnston. The last result was a 1-0 win to St Johnston. Very, very interesting for sure. Aberdeen coming off the back of a 0-0 draw with Motherwell. Not the best of games, but Aberdeen probably had better of the play. So they will think they they were a bit unlucky to go away with that uh, without a win uh, in that game. But um, coming back in front of uh, you know uh, Petaudry as well, a very very interesting game this one. As I've said, because John Johnston, they're coming off the back of a three 0 defeat to Rangers. I mean you don't play Rangers or Celtic every week, so you know that that's something you can say for sure for. Uh, St Johnston, uh, really difficult one to call, I know St Johnston won the last meeting between the sides, but I'm going to go for Aberdeen here, I'm going to go for them to beat St Johnston, I think it'll be a narrow victory here, Aberdeen 1, St Johnston 0, I'm going to go for, I'm going to go for a 1-0 win to the Dons in this one, and now we have Dund United against Motherwell, the last five between the sides have resulted in, 3 wins to Dund United and 2 wins to Motherwell, the last result was a 3-0 win to Motherwell, but to be fair, Dund United, another win over on, under their belts. 2-0 against Kilmarnock last, last time around. They're doing well. They are doing well on, uh, under uh, Mickey Mellon, and especially at home. That is one thing you can say. They're getting the majority of their points at home. So, really, really difficult one to call this one because Motherwell, as I've said, they're coming off the back of a 0-0 draw with Motherwell. And it is going to be a really interesting game, this one, because... Mother, as I've said, did win the last meeting by three goals to nil. I think Dund United will get another win under their belts, and I'm going to go for a 2 1 win to Dund United. I think Dund United will win this one. It will be a very hard game to predict, but I'm going to say a, one, uh, uh, a 2 1 win to Dundee United. And now we have a game that's probably a foregone conclusion in many other, many other people's eyes, but you never know. You never know. It is, it is football. It is the Boxing Day games. Hamilton against Celtic, who, to me, are finding their form again, you'd have to say. Uh, last five between the sides, resulted in five wins to Celtic. So, you know, that's probably one thing you can say for sure. Uh, the last result was a 4-1 win to Celtic. Wow. Uh, Hamilton, 2-0 defeat to Livingston. Let's be honest, Livingston had the better of the play. They were much, much better, you know, defensively as well. So, that 
you know, that's a bad result for Hamilton because it kind of puts them nearer towards Ross County and St Mirren as well. Celtic, though, they are getting back to their form. 2-0 against Ross County. Very, very good performance from Celtic. Uh, they're only going to get better. They're only going to get better. So, Celtic love playing Hamilton. Hamilton hate playing Celtic. Uh, there's only one one result here. Hamilton nil, Celtic 4. I'm going for I'm going for a 4-0 win to Celtic. And then we have Kilmarnock against Livingston. The last five between the sides resulted in three wins to Kelly and two wins to Livy. The last result was a 2-1 win to Kilmarnock. But Kilmarnock's form has been really up and down. And another defeat to Dundee United at the week, uh, uh, midweek there. Not great. Not great from uh, from Mullerwald, uh, from uh, Kilmarnock at all. So, Alex Dar is definitely under pressure. You can definitely say that for sure. So, I actually think, looking at this game, Livingston can go into this game looking at another away game. And, you know what? Livingston have now won away at Dundee United. They've won away at St. Johnston. And they've won away at Hamilton. So that's three wins away from home this season. That was more than last season. So, you know, Livingston, obviously David Martindale is the new manager uh, for Livingston. And I'm absolutely delighted for him. Absolutely delighted. He's, he's obviously turned his life around. Great to see from David Martindale. So I'm going to go for Livingston to win this one. I'm going to go for Livingston to win at Rugby Park. Don't win at Rugby Park very often. I think the last res- I think the last time they won at Rugby Park was probably 2002-2003 season. Or maybe 01-02. I think it was a 5-1 victory. So if, uh, if we could co- co- copy that result, then that would be absolutely fantastic. But uh, I am going to go for Livingston win here. I'm going to go for them to win on Boxing Day. Kilmarnock 1, Livingston 2. I'm going to go for a 2-1 win to Livingston. And we have Ross County against St Mirren, the final game of the Boxing Day fixtures. The last five between the sides have resulted in two wins to County, two wins to St Mirren and one draw. The last result was a 2-1 win to Ross County. Well, Ross County, first game under John Hughes. Uh, at least they managed to keep the score down against Celtic. That's, you can say for sure. Um, but it's going to be a very tricky game. It's going to be a very, very tricky one to call this one because as I've said, Ross County are uh, you know, Ross County are bottom of the league as, as well. St Mirren, they're coming to the back of 1-0 defeat to Hibs. Uh, Mason will be missing this game because obviously he's suspended after getting two yellow cards, like Christian Doidge as well. So, really difficult one to call, but I'm going to go for the home side in this one. I think Ross County will win this one. Ross County 2, St Mirren 0. So that is it. That is match week 20 done and dusted. As I've said, leave your predictions in the comment section down below. And like... Mike Eddy, you will get a shout out in the next video. So, my predictions are as follows Rangers 2, Hibernian 0, Aberdeen uh, 1, St Johnston 0, Dungeon United 2, Motherwell 1, Hamilton 0, Celtic 4, Kilmarnock 1, Livingston 2, and Ross County 2, Simbirin 0. Now that's it, that is match week 20 done and dusted. As I said, leave your predictions in the comment section down below. And I hope everyone's having a very good Christmas. I hope everyone is having a very good Christmas. I'm sure everyone will enjoy the Boxing Day fixtures that are coming thick and fast for sure. And we've got games on the 30th as well. And then we have also games on the 2nd of January as well, including the old firm game that is coming up very, very soon. But until then, it's goodbye for me. If you do like this content, please hit that subscribe button. Smash a like on this video as well. And uh, yeah, we'll see what happens on the Boxing Day. Rangers against Hibs, the featured game. And we'll see what happens. And I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye for now.